Welcome back to a story about uh, the kind of manufacturing that really makes you think of a bygone era, but it is still very much alive in the U.S. Giant train locomotives rolling off the assembly lines right here in North Texas. Dan Godwin takes a look in this week's Fox Forward. A few years back, GE could have located its locomotive plant in many different places around the U.S., but the company chose a site in Fort Worth, about a mile west of Texas Motor Speedway, and it's a decision that's working out well for everybody. Great to welcome the plant leader, Walter Amaya. Thanks Good for morning. coming in. Great, great to meet you. <laughs> Thanks. So this facility, it is large. We're talking a million square feet. I mean, that's large even by GE standards. That is correct. Yeah. And, and these locomotives are, are really big as well. What, what are the dimensions? What are we talking yeah, about? A locomotive measures up to 73 feet long. long. Okay. And they can weigh up to 430,000 pounds wow. and, each one. And you're producing about, what, six a week, and these are sold to railroad companies around North America. That is correct. We're building the, our legacy product is called the Evolution Locomotive, in, which is used here in North America. Yes. The Evolution Locomotive. That and then right next to the locomotive plant, you've got what's called the mining plant, where you're producing, what, motors and transmissions for these huge dump trucks that are used in mining operations. Yes. That is correct. That is a very important part of our business as well. We support the mining industry, and here in Fort Worth, we're building those drive systems used around the world on uh, mining, uh, mining sites. Okay, uh, well more than 500 people employed at the two plants. What were the factors that went into locating in Fort Worth? Right. We wanted to have a location that could bring in a great pool of talent uh, we wanted to be close to our customers, so, so we, we spent a lot of time hiring the right people and then spending time developing them, but also being able to partner with the right uh, institutions in the area, colleges, the business uh, uh, community. So Fort Worth and every other city around North Texas would, would love to attract more of these kinds of manufacturing jobs. What would be your advice to these communities who, who, who now, like that, to do that, that? That's a great question, Dan. So education, we believe, is very important. And we do a lot to try to uh, foster and improve and cultivate that uh, math and science parts. And I think it's also our responsibility to make sure that we support those academic institutions. And that's something that we take very seriously and we do. But the other one is infrastructure. Having that access to a rail, having access to the right roads and infrastructure is very, very important for any, any manufacturing site to flourish. All right, Walter Amaya, thank you so much. For more information about the two GE plants in Fort Worth, as well as possible hiring opportunities, we've got a link at our website. Just go to myfoxdfw.com and click on links.